This here is the Panasonic BLF19 battery. This is the battery used in GH5, GH5S and G9. This here is the new BLK22 battery. This is the battery you get with uh, Panasonic S5. Now, if you look closely, you will see this new battery has two sets of contacts. These here uh, on the upper side are used by the S5. But these four here, they are used by the S5, uh, by the GH5 and the G9. So basically, you can use uh, the new battery in your old GH5 or G9. How considerate of Panasonic! Uh, now the thing is, uh, these batteries are not uh, identically shaped. Uh, as you can see, the new BLK22 uh, has this. This part here is differently shaped. So you can insert. BLK22 in your old G9 and GH5, but you cannot physically insert the old uh, BLF19 in the new S5 camera. Uh, for anyone who had GH5, for example, was shooting video, uh, a lot of guys have probably like, like a dozen, half a dozen of these batteries for video, and basically you cannot use them anymore if you upgrade to S5. Personally, for me, that is not a problem. I just want the new battery, which is slightly higher in capacity. I will use it in my G9 and everything will be fine. So I bought the new battery, uh, which by the way is more expensive, like 20 euros or so. And I'm back home and I want to charge it for the first time. Now what? Seriously? This battery doesn't fit in all G9 charger. Let's see. Oh yeah, here's the problem. The BLF19 has these cutouts here and the new uh, BLK22 doesn't have them. So, I mean, how is this possible? How, how can they make a product which at the same time is compatible and is not compatible? What is this like a Schrodinger's battery or what? I can still charge this battery inside the camera and this is what I will do, but this is not my preferred way and I had no idea about this. Here Panasonic, I will give you a free advice. This here is Canon LPE6. There are also LPE6N and LPE6NH, which are just higher in capacity, but otherwise completely identical batteries in size and shape. So all the Canon cameras for more than a decade which use LPE6 can use any of the LPE6 versions. So these are like, I will put it on the screen, there are like more than 10 or 12 cameras which use this battery. Amongst other things, this is how you build a system, this is how you keep customers, by making things cross compatible forwards and backwards. And this here, I don't know what to say about this. I had no idea about this, so now I'm telling you, you can use the new battery in old camera, but you can you cannot charge it in original charger, you will need a new charger, or you can just charge it in the camera. And yeah, that's about it. I mean, this is, this is completely ridiculous.